after watching the movie, Gifted Hands, which was inspired from the story of Ben Carson. From the age of five, I wanted to be a medical doctor, a general surgeon to be exact. All of a sudden, I started hearing my uncles and aunties prompting me to look towards AI and ICT. They kept prompting me about so many careers that have gone extinct over the years, like shorthand, secretarial studies, and even computer science. And maybe, just maybe, in the year 2038, when I would have finished from medical school, there'll be no need for my dream profession. So I should just start thinking of a more futuristic career. Then, in class one day, my ICT teacher taught my classmates and I how technology is not meant to take over all the jobs humans do, but to aid humans to achieve massive success in areas where man has been limited. He explained to us landmark achievements and real-life applications of AI complementing humans, which include AI is helping us make scientific breakthroughs. AI systems can now think almost like humans. In 2024, AI helped with a discovery that won a Nobel Prize. AI analyzes complex data, speeding up research in science and medicine. AI and doctors work better together. AI helps doctors read scans like MRIs faster. It suggests treatment plans just by looking at patient data. In hospitals, AI helps in emergency rooms to sort and treat patients quicker. This saves lives and lets doctors spend more time caring for people. AI boosts creativity and strategic thinking. AI helps artists and designers come up with new ideas quickly. It supports creative people without replacing their imagination or control. In businesses, AI does routine tasks so workers can focus on meaningful work. AI is changing jobs, but creating new ones too. Some simple jobs may go away, like data entry and customer service chatbots. But even more new ones will be created that will need humans to use AI tools. Learning to work with AI is important for future careers. AI helps people by boosting productivity. AI takes over boring tasks so people can focus on meaningful work supports decisions. In fields like healthcare and finance, AI helps them make better choices by analyzing data, works as a partner. The best results comes when AI and humans team up, each doing what they do best. Improves career skills. Learning to work with AI gives you an edge in today's job market. Let me tell you something. Do you know that in the future, medical doctors will work with super smart robots and holograms to help people live longer, happier lives? I still remember the day I watched the Walt Disney animated movie called Big Hero 6, produced by Roy Connolly. In the movie, there's a friendly robot named Baymax who helps people feel better. One scene really stood out. Baymax works with Hero, a young boy, to scan people using amazing technology and even creates a medical hologram. I thought, wow, that's what I want to do. I want to be like Hero and have Baymax as my body. I want to be the doctor who uses technology to help people everywhere. From that moment, I knew that what my uncle said about the future of medicine isn't entirely true. 
The medical practice isn't just about hospitals and stethoscopes anymore. There will be a lot of innovation. Right now, hospitals in Nigeria and nations all over the world have embraced technology. Technology is being used to save lives in the coolest and smartest ways possible. The movie didn't just make me smile. It opened my eyes to all the endless possibilities in the world of medicine. Technology is like a superhero sidekick to doctors. It is already helping them perform their jobs faster, better, and smarter. Let me tell you why I'm no longer threatened by the use of technology in my career prospects in medicine. Just visualize this. The heart beating in 3D right in front of you, like it's floating in mid-air. Doctors are already using holograms to learn about the body and practice surgeries. The medical robots in China, Xiao Yi, the AI doctor developed by iFlyTech Company Limited. Xiao Yi is an AI-powered medical robot that made history by passing China's national medical licensing examination, becoming the first robot to achieve this feat. These are super smart computers that scan x-rays and find diseases even faster than some doctors. They don't replace doctors. They aid doctors to do their jobs better, like super detectives for health. We also have robotic arms that carry out surgeries with super precision. No shaking hands, no mistakes. Just a robot body in the operating room. Do you know that doctors in training practice surgeries using virtual reality before ever touching a real patient? How cool can that be? It will dispel all their fears since they've had a prior successful practice using virtual reality glasses before the real life surgery. It would be like playing a game where you learn to save lives. That would be so much fun if you ask me. Now, to get medical supplies to war-torn locations of very remote villages without any fear of human casualties. Tiny flying robots can carry medicine to those places that aren't so accessible, expanding the reach of medical care. This is a good reason to embrace technology in the study of medicine. I'm no longer worried about technology taking over my dream of becoming a medical doctor. It would help me, and everyone who embraces it now will achieve greater feats. Like Dr. Bertola Mesco said, artificial intelligence will not replace doctors. Rather, doctors who use AI will replace those who don't. I owe my new way of seeing my future to my great school, Fontage International School, for showing me the endless possibilities in every single learning experience using smart boards, learning coding, and delivering projects using videos and PowerPoints. Learning is now more fun and future focused. So here's my message to everyone. Don't be afraid of technology taking over most jobs. Let's ride on technology. Let's teach robots how we want them to help us. I no longer see a bleak future, but a bloomy future. Again, let's always remember what Dr. Bertola Mesco said. Artificial intelligence will not replace doctors. Rather, doctors who use AI will replace those who don't. Thank you.